What is going on everybody? Matatu 22 here today bringing you guys another figure review. Just the empty packaging today guys. No, I'm kidding. I, I got the figures. I, I got the figures They're already out of the box. So today guys, we got the Undisputed Era Ringside Exclusive 3 pack. Got this set for Christmas, so very happy about that. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at it. I don't know why I said that like a mafia boss. So you can see you got Undisputed Era on the back, a shop to system, something they say. First time in the line, baby. I like that. I like that. I never noticed that until now, but it's kind of funny. Got Kyle O'Reilly, Adam Cole, Bobby Fish, and I like the design of the packaging. And then you could see those three gentlemen on the side right there, and I can see at the top. And the same thing except on the other side, except it's got WWE. And on the back, you can see an image of those three with statistics for all three of them. There you go. Riley. And a brief bio, which I'm going to show you guys. So there it is. If you want to read that now, feel free. It is quite long. But uh should probably go ahead and pause the video. Alright, so that is the packaging. I think it looks pretty cool. This was definitely nice. Whatever you would expect to be on the bottom is on the bottom. Alright. So I'm gonna run through each each of the three figures. And then uh they all share the same articulation, so I'm only gonna go over it with one of them. So let's start with Kyle O'Reilly. I don't think the face sculpt is great here. I don't think they really nailed it. I mean, it is decent enough. So there's that. He's got the Undisputed Era t-shirt on. It's a nice fabric shirt. That's nice. And then the armband is painted on here. Uh, remember that because that will come into play later. So for him, it's painted on right there. And then he's got the white wrist tape with multiple fingers taped up. Show you his ring gear. Very cool, disputed logo right there. Not gonna go to the trouble of taking the shirts on and off because, uh, well, you guys have seen a Mattel upper body before. And then on the knee pads, he's got the Undisputed Era logo right there, and then KO right there. And then his boots. Boots are pretty nice. So yeah, overall, Kyle O'Reilly, de decent, decent enough figure. I, I, I like him. All right, now we got his partner, his former partner, I guess, Bobby Fish. Face sculpt on Bobby Fish, I think, is a lot better. I think it's a lot better. They got that kind of toothy grin that he's known for. And then no armband whatsoever for him, not even painted on. I did take the shirt off, so don't know why no armband for Fish, but he's got the black. Uh, you know the black sleeve that they wear with the white wrist tape? as well and then on his ring gear he's the well he's got infamous on the back it's pretty cool and the, the fish the fish skeleton which he's known for I, I, I like i think in terms of i think in terms of paint apps and in terms of the gear i think bobby fish is the is the winner of the three same knee pads as kyle o'reilly but He's got the same Undisputed Era one, except on his, it's just got a stripe. And then, cool, his boots are very cool. He's got the Red Dragon logo back from the Ring of Honor days. So that's a nice touch. And then this fish right there, and then the Tombstone, and then the Plus. So never noticed those before, but really nice. It really uh, knocked out some detail on the boots. So I definitely appreciate that. And then we have the leader. We have Adam Cole face sculpt i think is good i think they i think they got it again i just wish they gave him more of a smirking kind of grinning face sculpt now here's the other thing with adam cole the sleeve is a separate the armband is a separate piece so remember kyle o'reilly was just kind of painted on for adam cole it's a separate piece and then bobby fish doesn't have one at all so i don't really know what happened there uh other than that Cole's probably the plainest. Nothing on his knee pads or boots. 
just got the black wrist tape this gear it's got the AC over there and then baby on the back I like the hair sculpt although I think it's maybe a little bit long but that's just that's just that's just my opinion I don't I don't think I don't recall his hair to be this long but I could be mistaken guys that's just me that's just me uh, the hair is a little long for me all right articulation we're just gonna go over it on Adam Cole so head moves side to side you get a forward and back Bar moves up to here in the here back this far of course the shirt is fabric so it doesn't inhibit the articulation too much he's got a bicep swivel single jointed elbow wrist rotation and wrist hinge we got a diaphragm joint and an ab uh, diaphragm joint. waist twist and an ab crunch hips move out this far kicks that far forward kicks that far back thigh swivel double jointed knee and then a boot swivel which is always a nice touch and he's got ankle pivot and ankle rocker. So there you have it. There is the three members of Undisputed Era. Obviously, as they stand now, we are missing. That's best to just... We are we are missing Roderick Strong. I know we're getting a basic Roderick Strong, but hopefully we'll get an Undisputed Era 1 pretty soon. But these are nice figures. Uh, again, I don't know if they're worth... I don't think they're necessarily worth the price. Um, in my opinion, I think they're pretty... I think they're pretty basic, unless you have an attachment to these, th these three guys. If you have an attachment, then you maybe want to pay it. But again, for me, I got these as a Christmas present. But they are good figures nonetheless. I think if you do bite the bullet and you do pay for them, I think overall you will be happy with these figures. And I hope you were happy with this video, guys. If you were, please hit that subscribe button. If you're watching this video anyway and you're not subscribed, go ahead, just go ahead and hit it. Just why not? No, no one's no one's gonna no one's gonna stop you though. No one's gonna stop you if you don't want to hit it. Please also like this video, share it with your friends, leave me a comment social media links in the description as always that is all the time guys and of course facebook.com slash sanctuary youtube.com slash sanctuary go check both those out other than that i have nothing else to say so thank you guys again have yourselves a great day and i will catch you next time with another figure review and bye quick thing i forgot to mention stop mattel stop posing your figures in the packaging stop it just make them in the packaging vanilla pose because then their joints are all messed up and they don't move and they don't articulate properly that was the case with all three of these i had to run all three of them under hot water it pissed me off stop posing your figures in the packaging just vanilla pose them we we don't need you to demonstrate your packet your your posing abilities we'll, we'll, we'll take your word for it mattel Vanilla pose in the package and good night.